Three things that matter most for excellent wireless device performance are antenna, antenna, antenna. Of course, it's also important to consider radio performance. A smartphone, for example, contains multiple antennas and radios that must operate simultaneously without interference. Moreover, the phones must also operate in the vicinity of other electronic devices in large, complex electromagnetic environments, such as an office or home. In the next few minutes, we'll share how you can design multiple antenna and radio systems in a unique integrated workflow that combines ANSYS HFSS, EMIT, and Savant. The smartphone design that you see here includes GPS, Wi-Fi, and tri-band cellular antennas that can suffer RF coexistence issues. Digital signals on the phone's circuit board can also radiate unwanted emissions that may couple to the antennas and cause interference. You'll see how our workflow can solve these issues. We begin by simulating the phone model in HFSS to predict the installed antenna performance and coupling among antennas and signals on the PCB across a broad range of frequencies. This coupling information can be used by a unique tool called ANSYS EMIT to evaluate the effects of interference on radio system performance. We can launch EMIT by invoking the HFSS and EMIT data link and simulate these effects. Platform and antenna coupling information from HFSS is automatically transferred to EMIT. Libraries and behavioral models of radio circuit elements in EMIT let you quickly configure RF systems to model their performance in real-world operating conditions. This includes interference from other radios and unintentional emissions from the phone's circuitry. The red squares in the scenario matrix indicate that several RFI issues must be addressed. You can quickly diagnose complex issues like intermodulation products. Even the precise path of all interference is seen in the interaction diagram, identifying root causes of problems. Once identified, mitigation measures can be simulated to gauge their effectiveness, ultimately allowing you to produce an interference-free design as indicated by the green squares now seen in the scenario matrix. The interference-free smartphone design can suffer degraded performance in a large, complex electromagnetic environment, such as a home or office, due to the presence of other wireless devices. To simulate this scenario, you can invoke the link between HFSS and Savant. The data link exports the phone geometry and field solver results to drive a Savant SBR Plus ray tracing solution for modeling the performance of the phone in an electrically large environment. To illustrate, we'll place the phone in a smart home in the presence of other wireless devices. SBR Plus accurately captures and quantifies the interactions among wireless devices. Electromagnetic fields over large regions can be visualized, revealing areas of direct coupling, fading, or blockage. Further studies in EMIT can predict interference among all these wireless devices as well. Using this ANSYS design flow, you can design from antennas to radios all the way up to large and complex RF environments. Thanks for watching.